Hi there everyone, this is Max at Polar Audio here. We are the official UK distributor for radial tone bone pedals and today we're going to be having a look at the tone bone tri-mode. The tri-mode is a premium distortion and overdrive pedal with two channel operation and a genuine 12 AX7 tube in there to give you a very natural dynamic distortion and overdrive sound. It's modelled after classic American tube amps so you'll get everything from vintage Fender combo sounds right through to more modern sounds such as the Mesa Boogie dual and triple rectifiers. So let's go ahead and have a look at the pedal. To begin with, it's in true bypass mode. That's a very pure signal chain going straight into your amp, preserves the integrity of your clean sound. And then we've got two channels of distortion overdrive with separate drive and EQ voicing controls. This effectively turns your single channel amp into a very versatile three channel workhorse with separate clean rhythm and lead tones. <laughs> So going from right to left on the pedal from our input stage, we've got separate drive controls for channels one and two. We've got a filter to add in or roll off some of the top end and presence that basically functions like a presence control. We've got separate low and high EQ controls. And then we've got the individual levels for our two overdrive channels, which we can set. Below we've also got drive settings, so you can choose between a low, medium and a high setting depending on the type of amp you're trying to emulate. We've also got individual mid-boost switches for each overdrive channel, which means you can leave your rhythm sound nice and tight and flat, and then add a bunch of mid in to sweeten up your lead tone on channel 2. And then finally we've got an overall top end to just decide how much presence and, and, and bite is on the, uh, the pedal as a whole. Today I'm playing through my Washburn N4 guitar, which is a dual pickup guitar, so we're going to basically get some kind of Les Paul type sounds out of this today. I'm playing through a Fender Blues Junior 3 tube combo amp, but I've got that set absolutely clean, so every bit of overdrive and break up you hear is going to be coming from the Trimo pedal. Here's my clean amp sound. That's in true bypass mode at the moment through the pedal. We'll start off with a low gain setting to give us kind of soft breakup sound on channel one, and then we'll switch to a kind of bluesy overdrive sound on channel two for kind of a bit of a Stevie Ray Vaughan type sound. So let's hear how that sounds. Okay, so now I'm going to switch to channel 2 on the tri mode with the same voicing settings. It's a little bit hotter as it's designed for the solo channel, and then we'll hear how it sounds with a more of a bluesy sound. So that was a classic Fenderish bluesy tone using the low gain setting. Next up we're going to switch it up into the medium gain settings and kick in some voicing switches to add some mid-range to the solo channel. I'm also going to add a delay on channel 2 using a stereo wire cable um, which goes from a single stereo TRS tip to dual mono which means you can leave your delay on the whole time um, and not have to tap dance when you want to kick it in. You basically switch to the channel and the delay is already there ready to play. So I'm going to switch up to the medium gain setting. I'm going to leave the mid boost as it was on channel one just to keep things nice and crisp on the arpeggios I'll be playing. I'm going to add in a 7 dB mid boost just to add some sweetness to the, uh, to the lead tone and I'm going to make the whole pedal a bit brighter just to help those arpeggios and lead tones pop out a bit. <laughs> Thank you. 
So that was a medium range gain setting with a more kind of 80s flavoured amp. Let's kick it up into the 90s and noughties, take it to the high gain setting and give you something a bit more sort of metal sounding and kick in some of those other voicing filters as well. So I'm gonna jack up to the high gain setting. I've got my channel one drive all the way up. Channel drive two as it is. I'm just gonna turn up the level on channel one just a touch, just to equalize it with the other, the other channel. And then I'm gonna go for a big 12 dB mid boost just to get a really sweet singing solo tone. <laughs> As we said, the Trimode's got a genuine 12AX7 preamp tube in there, which means it responds just like an amp. So even at these kind of high gain settings, if I roll off the volume, it cleans up just like a tube amp would. Okay, so that was the Tone Bone Tri Mode, giving you the sound of classic American amps in a two channel pedal with a genuine 12AX7 tube. If you like the core overdrive sound of the Tri Mode, but can live without the two channels, um, but want the tube in there, minus the effects loop, there's also the Tone Bone Classic, which is essentially the same overdrive circuit, voicing and everything else, but just in a one channel variety without the effects loop. There's also the Bones Hollywood, which is a more compact version, which doesn't feature the tube, but does retain the two channel operation. The sound of the classic is ex exactly the same as the tri mode. If you'd like to hear the Bones Hollywood, then leave us a message in the comments section below, and we'll arrange a video for that so you can hear what the transistor version of this overdrive circuit sounds like. I've been Max at Polar Audio. Thanks for listening today. Hope you've enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe if you like what you've heard. There'll be more guitar stuff coming up too, and leave your comments in the comments section below. See you next time.